Hello everyone! In this video, I'm going to show you some basic modeling in 3ds Max, layer management and different types of clones. To create an object, go to this Create tab under Geometry, Standard Primitives, 3ds Max gives you a couple options over here. I'll demonstrate a few like box. You can adjust the size under parameter over here and um, the number of segments that is needed. Sphere, which is a ball. Plane. Uh, something interesting like a teapot and text plus. You can adjust the text over here. Like so. And text size. Okay. Under this tab, it's um, the shapes, splines. It gives you some options like making lines. You can click to add more points or hold to create some curve. Once you're happy with that, hit escape and there you go, you got a polyline. Um, there's option for rectangles, some others like circles and also another text function. Notice that the, so the difference between geometry and shapes is geometry objects comes with surface. Notice that the colors are all solid in geometry forms, but the shapes are just outlines. And for filing management, all of these objects, they are created as separate layers over here. You can create a new layer, I'll call this geometry, and then create another layer, call this shapes. And then to move the shapes into the shape layer, select, uh, select all the shapes, and then toggle this blue button onto the shapes and click on this add to active layer and then now they are all of these shapes are in one layer and then do the same to the geometry click on that Oops. select them move to a layer now the file is nice and tidy. We are ready for the next steps. Okay, to demonstrate clone, I've pre-made some of these boxes. To do a clone of this box, right click on it, select clone, and I'll use the copy clone for the first one. And do the same, right click, clone, select instance, drag it to the side. There's also a shortcut to cloning. You can hold shift key and then pull it to the side. And then for the last one, we'll select reference. So the difference between these three clones is how it relates to the main model. Copy clone is an independent version of the main box. So they won't affect each other. If I put a modifier to the main, it won't affect copy. Likewise, if I put a modifier to the copy, it won't affect the main as well. With the instance, it's a two-way relationship to main. So if I change main, instance will get affected. If I change instance, main will get affected as well. Like 
this. See there is a orange box around both of these, so they are affecting each other. With the last one, the reference clone, it's a one-way effect from main to reference. So if I add the modifier to main, that will change the reference. But if I add a modifier to the reference, see it doesn't affect the main. So that's it. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video.